don't be like those people. Don't be like your abusers. Don't be like your angry, grouchy, mean, bitter father that's always yelling and screaming at people. Don't be like your abusive mother that plays favorites with her children or cannot take accountability for the harm that they've caused. Don't be like your parents that talk at you and not talk to you. Do the opposite of what they do. Talk to people, not at them. Don't be like your apathetic parents that cannot empathize with you or show you grace or compassion. Be the person that can show people love, kindness, gentleness, nurture, grace, compassion, empathy, love. Give people the exact opposite of what you received. That is how you break the curse. Be a better older sister than your older sister was to you. Guide your younger siblings. Guide younger people. Younger cousins or friends. Guide younger people. Let them know it's okay to make mistakes. And give them love even when they do make mistakes. Don't shame them, shun them, mock them, or laugh at them in a derogatory way. Be a loving, safe space. Don't be like that older sister that didn't love and protect you. Be a loving, protective, feminine figure in people's lives. Don't be like that sibling that mocked you and made fun of you and teased you and allowed their friends to bully you. You be the type of friend, family member that sticks up for their family and their friends. The one that defends their loved ones and does not allow anyone to bully them or disrespect them. Don't be like your brother that did not protect you. Don't be like that big brother that was rude, mean, a bully, used you, took advantage of you, tries to control you, tries to play the role of your father instead of playing the role of your brother. You have proper boundaries with the people in your life and know your place. You be a protective figure. You be a kind-hearted, loving person in people's lives. The curse stops with you. Because despite all of the pain that you have went through, you will not inflict that same pain onto other people, especially the innocent. Your hands will not shed innocent blood. You are strong enough to handle it, strong enough to endure, and strong enough to never repeat it.